happy December 1st. Today's the first day of Vlogmas. I'm gonna be posting my videos weekly. Um, I think that'll work better content wise. I don't do enough in my day to do daily posts to be honest. But as y'all saw, I started my day off going to AutoZone because my check engine light came on. They told me it was my catalyt catal catalytic converter which is like pretty important since my light just came on they told me if i put this in my engine i mean in my uh fuel tank that it'll clean it out we're gonna be hopeful that it goes off in jesus name but um i'm at the gym my schedule i've been all over the place to be honest it's really hard for me to get out the bed but i'm at the gym now and i have a meeting at 12 and it's 11 a little after 11 so i'm just gonna do some 12 3 30 yeah so it's day one i'm actually very last minute but i think it's gonna be a good vlogmas and i think the content that i have planned is doable stay tuned y'all happy vlogmas let me know if y'all want to see anything down below let me start working out because i've not gone to the gym all week because of my car i don't like talking to people about cars because it just mm -mm. <laughs> y'all see that there is no engine light and that's on per won't you do it just got off my meeting gonna go home and then do some more work i kind of want to answer some emails really quick though i was literally on the call and i see a spider crawling and i'm trying not to like hop out the frame and kill the spider but it got to the point where i was like because mm -mm, i can't drive this car knowing the spider in here scratching because like that's how much it freaks me out i didn't kill it actually i let it out and it's you know roaming in nature where it's supposed to be we have some taco soup at home and so i don't have to buy a smoothie today which is great because i bought a smoothie like probably three times within a week taco soup is one of my favorite meals i can honestly cry when i eat it because it's so flavorful and i love food that just has so much flavor in it it's thursday this week has flown by i need to go to some stores later to do a little christmas shopping and kind of browse so we'll do that later once i get all this stuff done i'm in burlington right now i've been wanting to come here for a minute because burlington always has stuff that like you just don't think about and it's like here for cheaper if that makes sense so I'm just gonna look around and I also need to get a gift for a toddler because at the gym I go to they have like a tree for Salvation Army so I just grabbed one and um, I put grab one for my mom but I forgot so I'll do it tomorrow but it's due Saturday and today is Thursday so I'm just gonna find some things I'm thinking about getting her a coat a dress and it says a need she really wants a baby doll so I'm gonna really try and find that and i think Burlington has all that so hopefully this is the one place i'm going also don't like to go places by myself at night and you know it's six o'clock but it's dark i'd rather be safe than sorry but oh my gosh look at this beanie adidas beanie with a little puff at the top and it's 13 dollars i don't need it i just bought a scarf from here actually for like five dollars i think scarves are getting really popular again so like they have all the scarves big long and neutral colors i really need to get like new fedora hats because the ones i have like the brim keeps like getting slanted this is nine dollars i don't need this today that's the only thing coming to Burlington, i buy stuff that i don't need Ooh, that's a good one what hold on ten dollars it looks really big on my head right now. I'm gonna hold on to it because it looks like it's in really good condition. I don't know. I'm gonna just hold on to it. Y'all gotta check out their skincare section. I heard that like the Dove Spray deodorants aren't doing too well. That's probably why they have them all laid out right here. But they have some other spray deodorants. I don't know y'all. Like I just be buying stuff because it's so much cheaper. I'm too scared to try like some of the retinol stuff though. I need to read reviews because I'm not trying to mess up my skin. But they have like a bunch now this pure castile soap i might have to get this these are the good stocking stuffers too mm, i might get this oh i might need a buggy y'all somebody is calling me who was calling me what's up upgraded to a mini buggy i run across this and i'm like this is kind of smart having the pump at the top i kind of want to try one of these like 
vitamin C. I don't know, y'all. I be, it sounds so good. I want to try them all. And then, like, I be hearing about collagen, so I kind of want to try that. So, I think I'm going to buy these. They're only three ninety-nine. We're going to get that. I'm still not sure about the head. These reminded me that I want to get some more press-on nails because the light color ones I had, you can kind of see the glue underneath. So, I think I would want something maybe matte or just like a darker color in general. Not long, like these are like really long. This is cute, y'all. I have boots like this, but if y'all like these, go see they're in your um, Burlington. And they're actually my size and they're on sale for $32. I think mine are like from Pretty Little Thing or something like that, but I'm gonna just put them where I left them. I show y'all my OOTD, but I've worn this little two-piece sweatsuit from Shein a couple times, especially in recent vlogs. But I wanna show y'all that it's that time of year. December 1st, I had to bring out the Uggs. It's cold. They have more scarves here. And this, well, not the plaid, but like the scarf I got is this color and it's this big and it's a little bit thicker. It's kind of like this material, but yeah, y'all, these are cute. Y'all, these, I know I said I got black, but I don't have these. And these are not on sale. These are 50. These are so cute. If anybody watches my vlogs, you want to give me this for Christmas, family, here we are. These don't look cute, but they just look real comfortable. <laughs> I can get Uggs for all that. But I went to not playing with the boobs. Cause look at this. This is a little too out of my comfort zone with the height. I probably fall after the first two steps, but $30? They sell this for way more online. Well, I mean, once you include shipping. Check them out. Oh my gosh, look at these Nikes. This is when they sell Nike. Shoes. Okay, are these cute or am I just doing all this because it's Nike? How much? It's 30. Mm. Found some Barbies, but where's the black Barbies? Why is not Hallie? I want to get her this. This is like a really good jacket for the winter time, but it's 40 and I, this will be the only thing she gets if I got that. I'm not seeing many coats though. This is a cute little dress. Child, I don't really shop for kids, so I really don't even know. This, okay, maybe this. Do these pants come with it? Y'all ever be in the store and like someone's talking really loud on the phone, so you just listen to the whole conversation. You're like, and then what? What else happened? because I'm not sure if y'all heard that lady while I was talking, but like, there was some stuff going on at her job. Let me just see how much the jacket is. $18, I can barely see it. It's stuck with these pants. The material seems kind of cheap. This is kind of cute. I'm convinced everybody's child's a 3T because this section is so empty. I love these little guest dresses. The other one didn't have the G's all over it. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I have. So. This dress, super cute. I traded in the other ones for this mini one because I thought it was so cute and it comes with leggings. 15 and then this one is 13 and then we'll look at the toys and this might be all. I want a black Barbie. I don't even know if the little girl's black or not, but I would like some represent. <gasps> oh my gosh. Did I just speak her up? And it said baby doll. I'm not sure if she wanted like a Barbie or a baby doll. It said baby doll. And it's 15. Okay, I'm gonna put this in here in case I don't find anything else. Might get this one. <gasps> Tiana. Oh no, we're getting Tiana. It's a must. Oh my gosh. $16. Oh. Merry Christmas, little girl. That was the last Tiana I feel accomplished. I wanna go to the kids section. <laughs> Also on her list were um, learning games. And so I saw this and it's only $9. But I just want to check and see if it's like in her age group. What is it? It's a puzzle and you just put the pieces in there. I mean, uh, I don't think this is for her age. Oh, and I found another black baby doll. So I guess they're just not in the right place or they just spread them out. Learn Playmates. It's broken. Okay. Can't get my child no broken stuff. 
about to be so bad, but I think the bathroom's closed here, so we're just gonna hold her in. Little Miss Doctor? Is that a learning game? No. Okay, if you're three T, let me see how old this child is. She's three years old. So, our three year olds? You go to kindergarten at five, you go to preschool at four. I might can get her those letters, actually. I'm thinking I'm gonna get this. So I'm gonna get her wooden puzzle, Tiana. Oh my gosh, I wish I could see her facial expression. Should I get the dress or should I get this one? Decisions. I'm leaning towards what can she wear more? She can wear this more, but this is like a special occasion. Okay, I'm keeping the dress because this is on her wish list. Need baby doll, got that. And then it says, likes learning games i think this is a pretty good gift they didn't really give us a limit on how much to spend so i'm gonna put that back and i'm gonna put back the hat and i sped past the clothes section because i don't want to buy any clothes i really don't need them but i kind of want to look at them but where should i look at the men's jackets even though yusef has tons of jackets these are so tiny okay i'm gonna get these two they're eight dollars almost every time i go in the store they're playing janet this must mean i need to see her in concert again this jacket oh never mind i don't like it if y'all remember my last vlog i said i was looking for a full body mirror and this is really big and it's only 60 compared to the other one that was smaller and it was a hundred dollars at um target so and it's black and brown you might have to get it it matched my outfit I didn't really think about wrapping paper, but this is so pretty. That pink, Ooh, I'll have to come back for it. At least I know it's here. For some reason, I've been wanting one of these water bottles, thinking it'll motivate me to drink more water. I like the pink, but I kind of, I don't know y'all, I like black, simple. But I gotta be smart with my money. I've almost completed my Christmas shopping. I just need to get my sister one more thing and then send my sister some money for some of the other gifts that she bought that we're going half on. Okay, everything is kind of adding up, so I put everything for me back except the wipes. Oh, she kind of matched Tiana with the green. Look here, I'm like, dang, should I got an older kid because they probably don't get a lot of good stuff. When I get my mom's kid tomorrow, I'm gonna make sure they're older. Headed home, I got this stuff. Looks like I can see the little girl's face when she opens it because Tiana, everybody loves Tiana. Princess Tiana, let me put some respect on her name. I stayed up to four last night thinking that I could wake up at 9 a.m. I woke up at 12, 12 o'clock. That literally just took away everything I had planned today for, to do this morning. So I have to work the next three and a half hours and then I can go to the gym. I have turned in those toys It's hours and hours and hours later But I finally made it to the gym and I put some castor oil on my head because that's what I wanted to buy yesterday At Burlington, but I wasn't really sure if I trusted the brand. I look really ratchet, but it's okay What's the shirt today? Let love cast out fear. I have the presents with me, so we're gonna drop that off. It's 5.53, the gym closes at eight, so let's just get a move on. Dinner served. We got some Zaxby's with the Zax sauce, chicken strips, oh yeah, on our Palmer. I'm about to tear it up. Okay, good morning, y'all. I am getting ready for chapter meeting. It starts in like 30 minutes, and I went to sleep around like three, almost four last night, so you know where. We're keeping it pushing. She left out a little bit of edges, which I'm really happy about. Because... Sweet pearls kind of look a little big. I started using NYX primer on my eyebrows and then I brush it through to make the eyebrows last longer. I've got to be. Hi. Hi. We're back from the meeting currently three o'clock. So we were there for 12, one, two, four hours we took pictures got our new officers for the next two years and now i'm at counterculture it's a yogurt place frozen yogurt because it's a favorite of mine so i want to treat myself i normally don't come here because it's not close by please have a good one hold that for i'm in reverse gee okay sam's gonna show y'all the gift that they gave them nice little jewelry not a little a nice jewelry box Whenever I get told to wear all black to a meeting or just any professional meeting, I prefer to go for the pants instead of a skirt or a dress. It's just not my thing. I'm wearing this black jumpsuit that I thrifted years ago and it's still a great investment.
it's hours later and i see i saw that my sister's makeup i did not want to do it i literally was just woken up from a nap and i'm tired but i wanted to fillet i really want an eight count low-key i kind of want 12 count the weather down south right now is very fickle like cold one minute hot the next but as you're gonna see there's christmas lights in the back of me and you're about to see some coming up we have not decorated at all for christmas at my house i don't know what necessarily my mother is waiting on because it's literally december 2nd but i've not cleaned my room yet either so i'll be doing that once i get home it's been a chill day it feels like that meeting earlier today was like a long time ago where are doing? Okay, my camera died, but I've been finding some really good Christian hip hop music. It can hit the radio and be mainstream, like good. I'm like, oh, that's good. Cause I stopped listening to a lot of rap music. Once I start accumulating more, cause I've been finding a lot of good artists on Spotify, I'll make it into like a playlist that I can like share if anyone's interested in that. But I made Chick-fil-A. Literally, my camera died right when I got into the drive-thru. I'm in the side, so should I get an eight count, 12 count, eight count, 12 count, eight count, 12 count, eight count. Hi. How are you? Good, how about you? I'm doing well. Can I get your name? Taylor. Okay, and what can I get for you? Um, can I get an eight count? Oh, let me show y'all what we got at chapter meetings. The outgoing president, she gave us all this popcorn, and it's like, has some pink and green popcorn in it. How sweet. You green. I'm getting forced to get my boy to go to Walmart. <laughs> They don't have any nails that really stick out to me. These are kind of cute though. But while we're here, the closer we're gonna get to Christmas decorations, their wrapping paper is cheaper than Dollar Tree's because it's only 98 cents. And you know, Dollar Tree now is like 125. It's a sad day when Dollar Tree became not a dollar anymore. I mean, have you seen those TikToks where the, uh, the lady will like go to a random person and ask them if she wants them to do their hair and like she'll give them a whole sewing, apply a whole wig in like the aisle? Mm -mm. We have neighbors that I think, the ones I showed y'all earlier with the lights, I think they have like a little Christmas decorating war going on outside because last year, one of my neighbors wiped them out the park. Like the whole front yard was just like glowing. And this year, the other guy did up this game. So I think they got a little slight competition. I'm here for it. We're not entering to the chat. No, we're gonna lose. Let me show y'all what I was thinking earlier. There was someone on that aisle. Okay. I was thinking of doing the plain paper, maybe adding ribbon around it and having it like simple. But this is $5.98. And you know what? I think I'm gonna go the cheaper route and just use whatever paper I have. But it's 10 yards though, so I think that's actually pretty good. And I think it'll give like a classic Christmas gift look. That's very festive. Oh, these are cute. I just want y'all to know it's nine o'clock and it's like kind of packed. We expected the opposite. We stay in the black decor. This is cute. Little hair, okay. I'm not a huge ice cream fan, but I might try this just to see if it's, I wanna say worth the hype. Not even sure if it's hyped up, but we're gonna try it. I get some aesthetic shots. Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. I'm gonna be real with y'all this morning. So I'm currently on my way to church. I'm on my way to the last service. My earring keeps falling out, but it was the utmost struggle this morning to really like go to church, to be honest. I had like a mini headache. I started watching the 945 live stream. And then the way they do it is like, they only play it live. They don't keep it posted. I was in the middle of watching it and it turned off. All right, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna get up and go to church. $23.62 for gas. That's worth celebrating. But um, church was really good. You know, so convicting. Like he really been like, Really been preaching. Basically just talking about how everything that the Bible said will happen is happening. And we just have to open our eyes and see it. And how everything that the Bible says, the world rebels against it. We have to make a decision as Christians, are you gonna obey God and please God, or are you gonna try to please the world? Which sounds like, oh my gosh, easy, simple answer, please God. But you know, when you in that position, it does become a challenge. So happy that I got out and went to church in person to communion and if you know me you know i love the communion like the little tiny bread and the grape juice i don't know it's just it hits different good morning everyone it's the next day and i woke up lit again 
what's new. But we're leaving for Dallas today, so I'm about to head to Dollar Tree to get some snacks. Let me show you all the OOTD. This new top is my mom's top, and then I'm wearing these brown shorts that I got from Burlington, I believe, and I'm wearing my gold um, Nike Air Maxes with it. But I tried this new hairstyle that I haven't really done before. It's a side part, and then I did a claw clamp. It's, you know, it's simple, but it's something I haven't done before. See these packages building up? I need to wrap my presents soon. I also need to paint my ceiling soon. I started, but disregard that. Is that my car making this song? I hope not. For Adrian? Yes. Thank you. Y'all knew I had to get a smoothie. Y'all knew. It's been a while. So when did Dollar Tree not sell Chex Mix? Because I'm not seeing it anywhere. I think this is all I'm getting because these popcorn bags are basically air. So that's probably my best bet. I don't trust the hotel, but they have complimentary breakfast. And the last hotel we stayed at here didn't. So I don't have to like go anywhere for breakfast. So that's nice. And they do have a gym, so I will definitely be going to the gym. But right now, I'm not super hungry, but I might eat my food now. Because... Okay, let me bring y'all through the plan for tomorrow. So the plan is wake up around 7.30. Now y'all, y'all know I'm sleeping in. My goal is to go to sleep at 11, 30, 12 tonight. Read, I got my Bible right here by the bed. So I'm gonna go downstairs around eight, eat. We're gonna go to the gym downstairs. We're gonna walk 12 through 30. Then in the last 15 minutes, utilize whatever other equipment they have in there. I don't think it's a big gym and then come back up here shower and then the goal is to start work around nine good morning guess what time it is it is 8 14. we're up early but we're still behind schedule my sister wants me to take her to work in like 15 minutes so i'm gonna go downstairs to eat breakfast we got a muffin strawberry yogurt okay i dropped my sister off at work now we're gonna go to the gym i brought my headphones down here it's mm -hmm. eight 46. Ooh, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> but I'm making lunch plans with Bria. It's time for lunch. I saw there was a close by, so I think I want to get that before my meeting at 2.30. I got the food pretty quick. So I got some salmon. I got this salad. So what I'm thinking is I can save this for tomorrow. I got some potato soup, so I'll probably eat this now. I'm not super hungry. So my meeting starts in 26 minutes, so we're good on time today, y'all. We're good. We finished our work. My meeting was canceled, so here's the OOTD black champion crew neck this vest from my mom's closet i'm not sure where it's from oh, what's the brand oh old navy and then these glasses are from shein and then these black they kind of look leather but they're not these leggings are from walmart i did a video on this when i was buying clothes for walmart under like a certain amount of money and then these black shoes i'm actually not sure where they're from maybe ego but i was inspired to buy them from molly may i'm just wearing this black purse from aldo that's also my mom's and we're gonna head out and go to a thrift store probably Plato's closet it's a ladybug on my arm okay i think we're fine now i don't think there's any more ladybugs on me isn't that supposed to mean like good luck or something i just want to say that i know i'm dressed like oh it's a little breezy outside it's not at all it's really not so i'm sure i look kind of crazy Worse? you got two options you can go to www I'm sorry i was watching um 30 minutes with the perry anyway there's this song this worship song i just found and it's so good and it's so different and let me just give you a little a little sneak peek of it, a little hint I'm Shoot a light, keep things. It's time! 
But that's like Mariah. I definitely got way more than I intended on buying. So we're gonna do a little try on haul. But let's see if we can get this done in five minutes. First things first, I got this jacket. It's this red puffer jacket and it's the brand Pantone. And apparently that's the brand they sell at PacSun. I showed Yusuf. Um, he was like, oh, you know, those are normally unisex. So we're probably gonna share this. It was $20. And I've been wanting a red puffer jacket. Oh, I have a red puffer jacket. It just hit me that I have a, a red puffer jacket. I have one. Well, it's not this like pufferish. So cute. It looks really nice with this outfit. Like it's giving, let's go skiing. Really nice. Okay, yeah, $20. I think this is the only jacket I got. And then I showed you stuff this. And he was like, you know, I will buy that if I was at Plato's Closet. So got him this Tommy Hilfiger. It's a puffer jacket, but it's not as puffy as you can see. And it was $18. Here's the second thing I got. It's this green dress from Zara. Let me pick up the camera and show y'all. It's $14. Definitely have to wear a different bra under it because it's literally showing every little bump. I don't really have many green dresses and I should. And I just think it's really nice and flattering. It's not too short, which I'm a fan of. It gets like a throwback feel. Next, oh my gosh. So I tried this on at Plato's Closet because I just want to make sure I can fit it. It's a squeeze, but I love it so much. It's this snake skin long skirt. Okay, I put one boot on to show y'all the illusion of how it's going to look. I just think that's so cute and so flattering. Here's the third dress. Oh, she's a little short. I'm not gonna lie to you. But I wanted to get it because I was familiar with the brand. It's the Meshki brand and this was $10 as well. And on the back, it also has like the same type of like lace up detailing that you see on the front. Child, my butt is out. Maybe I should have tried this one on too. I don't even want to turn all the way around. I can wear it to a thigh highs and I can kind of make it like hide how short it is, I think. We move, we bought it, so we gonna wear it. And I can honestly probably wear like the leather, like pleather leggings I got. That can be a look as well. The last thing, this was $10 and it's brand new from Forever 21, size small. And I just love one brown and black and I just love zebra. And so I think this will look really cute with like some leather pants. Both my leather pants and my leather skirt are busted for me trying to put them on. But I love this. So maybe even my black ripped jeans will look cute with this. I was not expecting to find stuff I like. But also kind of because it's, you know it's vetted clothing. So it's not like it's just anything. But tomorrow I'm going to try and go to Goodwill. Um, I told Yusuf I might go to the playlist closet again because when I was leaving... They put out this Chicago Bulls windbreaker and I'm like, oh, that's kind of cool. This is kind of cute. I'll probably wear my black thigh high boots. 